Well, good, wonderful, beautiful morning, audience. Those two just wrestled for like forever, and now they're snuggling. I don't know if Shelby realizes that Kira's touching her, but they're like, oh, we're so tired, we're just gonna hang out together. Oh my gosh, I don't think that could get any cuter. <laughs> oh, good, wonderful, beautiful morning, audience. What did you find, Memphis? I guess you didn't really find it. Daddy found it. No, she found it. She found it? Do you see it? So that's one of the bricks on the side of our house. It's a normal sized brick. Right in the center there. You see he's looking right at us now too. Oh, little tiny baby frog! Oh my gosh, he's moving. He's gonna jump at me, he's gonna get me. I hope not, he's gonna scare the heck out. Ah! <laughs> I knew he was gonna do it. Ah, there he is. Look at him go. We should probably um, save you and get you out of here. The camera doesn't know what to do. The camera's like, what do I focus on? And he's under there. All right, well, apparently that's where baby frog friend lives. So we haven't really showed this in a video. The deck that Jamie magically made in a day. This is the deck Jamie made for the dogs. So I don't know a lot about how decks are made, but he managed to make this and then we put a railing up so the dogs can't jump out. And then we got these, <laughs> I almost called plastic ladder. I guess it's a ladder. Yeah. Steps, yep. yep. Look at this, kind of cool. We can see the dogs from up here. But anyway, we got this plastic ladder. So the dogs, are. it's easier for them to get in and out, but they're still learning how to get in and out of the pool. They can, they can get out, but we gotta coax them in. Yeah, yeah. I think once they, I think eventually they'll get it. Like eventually they'll realize this is cool. And even if they don't, I'm okay with that because then they don't get wet until we tell them to. But look at it, look at this. Look at it, I don't even know how you did this, but it looks perfect. <laughs> you did make that look perfect. It's not perfect. It's, it's close. perfect compared to what I would have done. Right. <laughs> Mine wouldn't have looked like that. Yeah, so actually, yeah, it's pretty close. It's pretty close. Uh, so, and then, what were we saying? Oh, hi Shelby, hi. Uh, you wanna come up here, go swimming? Yeah. Come on up here. Shelby likes to just sit up here too. She thinks it's great. So this pool, I don't know if we told you guys this, it's a temporary pool. In the winter time, the pool will have to come down. So we think we might leave the deck right where it is. And what were we saying? Like a temporary ramp, like a ramp. Yeah. So kind of like the A-frame, we'll build like a ramp and then have a little temporary thing so they don't jump off over here. And then in the winter time, the dogs can hang out up here and play on it. Which would be kind of fun. I don't know where they all went. They're all underneath it. Memphis likes to get under it, and Shelby likes to climb up and down it. Come on, Memphis! Kira. Memphis is like, Kira has me, guys. Hey. Can't, I can't. Whoa! <laughs> run, Memphis, run! Get her, Memphis. Get her, Memphis. Run, Memphis, run! They all run around. She's just gonna run underneath there. Hi, Shelby. How's it going? All right, I think we're gonna get the dogs in the pool. Good job, Memphis. Hi, Good job. Hi. Hi. <laughs> She's like, look guys, I'm on top of the world. I gotta see everything. You wanna get in the pool? Mm -hmm. You wanna get in the pool? Oh look, daddy's feet are in the pool. She's like, hmm, maybe. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Big old tongue. I think about it. All right, I'll get your life jacket. Oh, here comes, here comes Shelby. Here she comes. Yeah, yeah. hi Shelby. What do you think of this? Hmm? I think people were afraid you were going to be scared to come up here because you could see. Steps. Yep. Yeah. And because of there being no edge right there, but she did it, guys. She goes up and down it quite a bit and checks out the pool, but doesn't actually get in it. But I think there's that part of her that wants to get in it and just <laughs> doesn't make the leap on her own. She's like, come on, Dad, get in the pool with me. So the longer I stand out here in the sun, the more I want in. <laughs> yeah, it's warm in the sun. Yeah, I think we're gonna get in. What are you doing, Shorty? She's like, turn this sprinkler back on for me. I wanna play with the sprinkler. You wanna come up here and hang out with the rest of us? <gasps> What's this, Shelby, you wanna get in the pool? Do you wanna get in the pool? She's like, maybe, maybe I'll get in the pool. All right, I'm gonna go get my stuff and get in the pool. You gonna get in? No. How about you? Are you gonna get in? Shelby's like, nope, I'm going down. Menace. Menace. Boink. 
If you stay up here, she can't get you. <laughs> oh, Shelby's gonna get her now. <laughs> She's like, I don't know what you want me to do. Okay, snow goes, okay. We're trying to show them that they can see in the pool and reach the pool from this step. They haven't really figured that out yet. Stay. Look, now you can see the water. Oh, look, you can touch it. You, can drink it too, you don't need to drink tons of pool water. We don't keep it very chemically. We check it and make sure that it's really low. So a little bit of water ain't gonna hurt them. Right? Look at you girls. What are you doing? This hasn't a good time. All right. I'll go get your pool stuff and play in the pool. This is Kira's favorite game. To chase the sprinkler. Apparently it's not going fast enough for her. There she goes. This is the greatest moment of my life ever. Here barking. <laughs> I don't know how she doesn't get dizzy. <laughs> she gets so close and then she barks at it. I'm so close, I bark at it. I'm so close, I bark at it. Oh, you goofy girl. <laughs> oh my goodness. Good job. Good job. Hi. Come on. Good girl. You can't get out there. Come here. There you go. Get around her around. I will. <laughs> She's like, whoa. Look at you swimming. Can you get out on your own? Guys, I can do all of these things. I can do them all. <laughs> She's learning. Her butt sank, so she said, to... oh, she <laughs> Where's she going? Where's she going? Where's she going? Where's she going? <laughs> All right, so we just filmed a short video of the dogs in the pool. And what do we have now, Jamie? A bunch of dog hair in the pool. Not that. No, we have wet dogs. Uh oh. I could get the blower out and dry them off a little. Or we'll just use a towel and it'll dry naturally. They don't actually stay wet for very long, so a towel really will work. Shelby's like, dry me off and let me back on my couch. It was fun, but now I want back inside. Hey, hey, you want back inside? Can we dry you off first? Is that okay with you? Do you like your pool, Shelby? She's like, I like my couch, guys. Can I have that back, please? Yeah, in a second. All right, Shelby, dry yourself off. <laughs> it's a really pretty towel on you. So the girls played in the pool for a little bit. They really enjoyed that. And now I just finished making dinner. Now I gotta make dinner for them. I know I talked to you guys a little bit about the fact that Shelby does have kidney disease. And some of you saw my post that she wasn't eating a couple days ago, last weekend, whatever it was. Well, we got her to eat. She's not eating, and we knew she wouldn't. She's not eating the prescription dog food, but we've got her on a low phosphorus, lower protein-ish dog food that she is eating. And I'm kind of, it's a little bit of kibble and then other stuff that I'm mixing in it. And I'm slowly working her to another diet. Once I find one that she'll actually eat, I'll go through and like tell you guys more about it. She's getting beef tripe right now, which is disgusting, but she loves it. So as long as I get you to eat, it's all that matters. I've been weighing her every day to make sure that she's maintaining her weight and not losing too much. Yeah? She's like, guys, don't make fun of my girlish figure. No, you're actually doing really good, girl. Are you ready for dinner? 
Are you ready for dinner, little lady? We just tried to do a live stream. I tried to do it on my phone. Our internet has been really wonky, and of course it disconnected a whole bunch of times, and it was a little frustrating, which was sad, because I really wanted to hang out with you guys and talk with you guys, but hopefully that'll get fixed here soon, and we'll have to do another live stream. But I'm going to feed these girls the dinner. Oh, and side note. Um, it has been, what, three weeks? I still have the charger. I still don't have my Jeep back. Jamie and I wanted to go camping this weekend. We wanted to go last weekend, but I don't have my Jeep back yet. So we're kind of stuck because we can't pull the camper without my Jeep. I like the Charger. It's a nice car, but I am so ready to have my Jeep back. I don't know if we ever actually told you what the, the insurance adjuster or whatever said, but there was like $10,000 worth of damage done to my Jeep, which I think is overkill and excessive. I don't really think it was that much. They did have to replace my whole front bumper because the bumper was cracked and because it was cracked, they actually had to replace the whole thing because of uh, safety issues or whatever. And the paint was chipped and the windshield needed to be replaced, but I don't know, I just think it's excessive. I just hope that when I get it back, it's done and it's done right. The people that I took to are the people that fixed my bumper on the old one, so I'm sure it'll be done right, but I would really like to get my Jeep back. They told me a week and a half, then they told me two weeks, then they told me I would have it last week, Thursday. Now they're telling me I'll have it Tuesday of this week, so it's currently Monday while I'm filming this. We'll see if that comes true tomorrow. We'll see, won't we? We shall see. All right, I'll get you dinner. Yeah, I'll get you dinner. Well, after we had dinner, the dogs played a little bit, and now they're all sleeping. And it's time for us to go to bed. I don't know why you're sleeping on the floor. Oh wait, maybe I do. Because somebody stole the couch. <laughs> There's still space for you up there. You can still push her off if you really want to. So I was like, no, sometimes I like the floor too. <sighs> Alright you guys, we are calling it a night and we are going to bed. We hope you enjoyed today's video. As always, thanks so much for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Stay positive. Dream big. We will see you again soon. Good night, audience. If you love our huskies, come along for the ride. All you have to do is hit subscribe. Follow as we share our lives with our dogs and join our adventures on Snow Dog Vlogs.